Hello guys, Ivan here, and this is Mercedes AMG G65 Final Edition. And you can immediately see these bronze details in the front grille and also in other parts of this amazing vehicle. So this is a limited edition, only 65 vehicles worldwide. So this is the last G-Class with the V12 engine. And we can see these light wheel alloy wheels. These are five twin spoke design. And the tires are 295, 40, 21 inch. Behind the wheels we can find the AMG brakes. And these are continental cross contact tires. And here we can see the spec sheet of this car. So this is beautiful 6 point liter engine. And I will tell you about it a little bit later and here on the front fender we can see the v12 by turbo sign and this car is finished in black amg napa leather inside with the bronze details which i will show you a little bit later so really g-class is a legendary vehicle and as a tribute to this vehicle no more than one third of the g-classes sold are actually amg so that's why they did this edition and this is only last edition with the v12 engine we can see like edition one stripe on the side of the car and exhaust as is normally on the sides and this part is actually to decompress the cabin and in the back we can see the boot space which is covered with the cover and you have also the real full-size spare tire as is normal with the G-Class so here you can see that these are continental tires and the name of the tire is Cross Contact so it's very interesting and on the alloy wheels we can also find the AMG logo so this car actually has a 6.0 liter V12 engine which generates 463 kilowatts which is 630 horsepower and the torque of this engine is 1000 newton meters and this gives you really unique combination of driving dynamics and smooth running characteristics because the v12 engine is very smooth despite of its size so the acceleration from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour or 62 miles per hour is just 5.3 seconds and it reaches a top speed of 230 kilometers per hour and that's 143 miles per hour electronically limited by the way so here I want to show you the cabin which is really gorgeous and unfortunately the battery of the car was discharged so I only can show you this much but I decided to show you this because I think really this is a unique car, only one of 65 you can see here on the grab handle, G65 final edition. So yeah, I wanted to show you what I can show you rather than don't show you anything. So really a fantastic uh, design here with these bronze or you can say rose gold and details. Also the stitching and a Falterbach logo on the headrest. So really, I really like this interior. So in the doors you can find uh, diamond stitching on the leather and also rose gold or bronze details here with the electric seats. A really nice uh, materials in this car. So really gorgeous, even though you may say this is like old looking now with the new generation, but I still like this design. And final look at this car from the front so you can find the front distance camera front radar and also this cover from the bottom is also in bronze and also these parts in the front bumper so really fantastic AMG logo here in the front grille so this is really a gorgeous car and especially in this edition it's really unique car and it's one to have I think and it's a collector's item so here we have the key to the car, it has AMG logo on the front and a Falterbach logo on the back of the key fob, it is the new style key fob. And we have here this beautiful uh, G63, it is in G manufacture, 
So this paint is called the Night Black G Manufacture Magno. It is a matte paint, but as you can see, the light uh, really bounces off from this paint. So it is really, really crazy. And now I'm pointing on the details which are tied up to this edition. So the edition is called Stronger with Time. And I will tell you all about this edition. But right now, let's take a look at these alloy wheels. So here we have optional Brabus Monoblock Z Platinum Edition. So these are the 24 inch, which is, which is really crazy, 24 inch wheels on the G-Class. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's really, really crazy. So the front tire size is 295, 30, 24 inch. And the rear tire size is 355, 25, 24. So those are really chunky tires. And yeah, you have also from the series production, maximum is 22 inch wheels, which I personally like. And these are optional. So uh, you can decide if you want these wheels and you can buy them or you can have this car with, uh, with original wheels. So that's not an issue. So the edition stronger than time types like together a lot of optional extras like these mirror caps which are painted in uh, Magno Silver paint, in matte silver. The brake calipers are also uh, painted in silver. So we have also multi-beam LEDs and Burmester sound system with the surround sound system. At the front we can also see this AMG specific grill with the AMG logo on the right side of the grill. So you have 18 optional extras in this package. Also, you have wide angle cockpit, ambient lighting, and also the sunroof. So you don't really need more than this in this uh, case. Maybe a little, some uh, additional optional extras, but in terms of the design, it would be uh, really fine with this uh, Stronger the Time edition. And also the exhaust tips in silver are part uh, of this uh, pack, of this edition, Stronger Than Time. And we can see also there the silencer and the OPF uh, particular filter, which is uh, probably only installed in the vehicles in the Europe. And that's because of the regulation from European Union. So the Schuckel proofed uh, badge is uh, there because every G-Class is tested on the mountain Schuckel when it is uh, developed and then it has the, the proper off-road capabilities even more than you would uh, probably uh, drive uh, in your life but this car can do it so now let's open the bonnet the hood and check out uh, this uh, engine so this is 4 power liter by turbo engine which has uh, two turbos which are sitting on the top of the cylinder banks so this is like a hot V setup it is in handcrafted in a filter bag by one man one engine uh, principle and uh, this engine develops uh, 430 kilowatts 585 horsepower and 850 newton meters of torque that's 627 pound feet of torque the engine is mated to amg speed shift tct 9g gearbox the top speed is 220 kilometers per hour 136 miles per hour or 240 kilometers per hour 140 9 miles per hour with optional AMG driver's package. Takes only 4.5 seconds and this engine is mated to AMG Speed Shift TCT 9G gearbox, so 9 gears. Uh, so yeah, you know, I really like this engine. It has great sound and uh, it's, a, it's a masterpiece of an AMG which you can find in many, many AMG models. So also this part which I'm uh, pointing at, you can have it in uh, carbon fiber as an uh, optional extra.
So now let's close the bonnet, the hood. And it has a loud sound. Everything in this car has like a loud, uh, pronounced sound. Even the doors, uh, the hinges, everything is like uh, off road, it's like uh, brutal. Even the hazard lights, they are sitting like on the top of the front fenders above the light. So it is very, very uh, specific for the G Class. And you won't find it on any other cars. Also, this car is uh, special because competitors uh, don't have anything to compete with this car. So you either want a G-Class or you want, um, I don't know, SUV. So uh, it's really, really a special vehicle in, this, uh, in these terms. Also now uh, all indicators are LED. So really, really stunning uh, vehicle and uh, many people love and the black uh, color on the G-Class, it is uh, iconic and here with the Magno paint it's even more uh, like a stylish. Also in the US you can have this front bar, like, um, yeah, we, we can't have this in the European Union because uh, it's fantastic. So I would highly suggest to buy this if you are in the, in the US. So from the rear, really, you can see this boxy, uh, boxy shape and also the spare tire on the fifth door. So that's also uh, looks like a safari edition a little bit, <laughs> but that's always the case with the G-Class. It's iconic to have it there. And we have also this like uh, brushed uh, aluminum on this uh, spare tire cover. Also, these tail lamps are iconic. They are very small compared to the vehicle size, but uh, it works like that. The design language is uh, stunning. So this is one of my favorite, uh, favorite cars because uh, it is so so different to other SUVs and these uh, hinges which are like uh, open. It's really really nice and every sound is uh, pronounced. With new generation everything is even better and the uh, interior is uh, just something else in this in this new car. So let's now dive deep into this interior. You need to slam these doors, guys. Finally, after after almost 1.5 years, I can see this car in person, and uh, <laughs> it's funny because this car is so uh, requested by everybody that uh, it's insane. And uh, yeah, right now it's here, and even in special edition, stronger than time. So you can see it there. So finally. I shot the Brabus uh, version of uh, G-Class G63, but this is original G63 without the Brabus, but with the Brabus wheels. So let's check out here uh, the interior. We can see beautiful ambient lighting here in this uh, door handle. This diamond stitched leather in the doors. And we have here controls for the seats. And this is seat heating, seat ventilation. Super loud closing mechanism. It's like loading uh, a gun or something. So uh, really, really, this is uh, crazy, crazy good. This carbon fiber here and Dynamica. So let's uh, turn the ignition on here. We can see the AMG logo. Even like a glare in the logo. So this has the latest command system. I will show you now this car from the inside. So we have a gray pearl. This is actually better to see on the seats. So this is gray pearl and this is black Napa leather. And that's in stronger the time in this edition like this. We have this soft like uh, headrest. So this is the steering wheel. I will just turn on the ignition. And here emotion start is you do it like that. You turn on the ignition, then you put this into the Sport Plus turn off start stop okay now you need to hold one pedal either down or up and simultaneously start the car or you can just press and then hold so let's do this now we can hear this it's very convenient the exhaust is here So it's super convenient to shoot, I don't even need to get out of the car. 
so this is this is amazing just hear this need to slam the doors obviously every time uh, yeah I cannot decide if this is my favorite AMG or the four door there is also four door with Brabus wheels and other G63 in matte olive <laughs> so yeah GTR Pro I showed already that it's crazy this 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 showroom is insane so yeah we can see here the dynamica on the sides here is like a carbon fiber I call it like a, it's like a liquid so this has like a lacquer on it so beautiful you like expect you can touch this but this is smooth it's not like a, yeah insane and we have AMG logo here these are the dials from AMG one and the hypercar from Mercedes and you can uh, press here and then exhaust will be quieter you can, if you press on the display then you can change for example here manual or automatic drive auto start stop traction control this is exhaust and here you have uh, MG ride control so you can put this into the sport sport plus comfort or you can change it up so yeah so so nice and here you can change the dynamic select so we have a sleeper remote individual mode comfort sport and sport plus so you can see immediately how in sport plus the refs are idling uh, on a high refs it's idling so nice so we have these vents here and here we can see Burmester sound system which looks very similar to that to the indicator we have these two digital panels 12.3 inch screens we have marker here in black I can turn off the engine so we can so you can hear me better and so it's not light link without the purpose so yeah guys this is magnificent we have here the differential locks so here you can see this is front diff let me zoom in this is uh, middle diff and this is rear diff so if you press them they will like light up on orange and red and then you can go uh, like in super super heavy off-road in normal off-road you don't even need that so yeah we have start button and also st auto start stop so the, you can turn this off so we have this middle console it's in carbon fiber as well two cup holders and the socket 12 volt socket here you probably put the key fob i think if your uh, battery dies yeah here is the logo and this is middle armrest very soft beautiful napa leather so as you can see a lot of things can fit here like uh, chewing gums and <laughs> cables yeah a lot of things so these are the AMG seats for the G-Class so we can see here this diamond uh, cut diamond stitching and perforated leather so this is pearl gray pearl and black combination very very nice I really like this actually <laughs> who wouldn't right so we have here the ambient lighting let's change the let's change the colors here so we can put this you have 64 colors this is not touch screen that's like maybe maybe one minus of this car so with the multicolor options we have here the ocean blue then we have uh, it looks like this then we have uh, purple sky red moon fire red dawn blue sun yellow jungle green you can see there is stripe and also you can see here are some stripes 
this is glacier blue I call this uh, Petronas blue you have also it here during night this is more visible but yeah it's really really amazing so here we have the carbon fiber trim around this place and here on top of uh, is uh, AMG Nappa leather, some vents, stitching and uh, these are the pedals good to press we have this rubber all weather all year not all year but winter winter rubber tires that they look like original because they have G in the same font like a G class so yeah these are the winter floor mats here you have a glove compartment car manual this is the MG private lounge envelope so we can sign up for private lounge and this is uh, yeah, manual to the cars so that's that and the door packets are huge you can see there is a Burmester as well door packets are huge and the carbon fiber trim here beautiful leather here so yeah amazing amazing we have here AMG logos and check the check these out S65 facelift S65 pre facelift okay game over so you can close this manually because why not it's it looks uh, more badass if it's not electric and you can open the panorama roof here with the button for ventilation or you can open it fully here to have a fresh air and yeah, you can hear uh, surroundings better and get a 10 <laughs> so that's great and it's lightly tinted the, the panorama glass so here we can see uh, you have a light here microphone uh, this is mirror obviously and you can grab this it wouldn't uh, fall off don't worry <laughs> so that's great and uh, what we have as else here so here with these buttons here you have a dynamic select so if you press it you will change it from uh, this mode so you have slipper remote individual you can set it up how you want then we have a comfort mode sport and sport plus is the the most sportiest here AMG right control a manual or automatic drive traction control turn it off volume home button button back exhaust button 360 camera low range this is for for the off-road and beautiful uh, IWC Schaffhausen clock so it's here and we have uh, some buttons here for navigation radio media this is for the AC uh, this is this is auxiliary heating so you can preheat the car from the app from the phone to so have here suede leather and also here on the top speaker Burmeister on the top so we have a surround sound so let's check out here the displays so you can have here the performance with the boost temperature of the gearbox and engine then you have uh, these modes which you can change you have uh, AMG track pace so super super modern and you can uh, put these in different design so you have a sport it looks like this one dial and it will go red if you want to shift and then you have a classic and then a progressive So my favorite is classic or sport. We have also here like a carbon fiber. And here you can put also like a navigation. So it's super, you can control it here on the steering wheel. Service. So you can see tire temperature, when is the service engine oil level. Assistant, so super, super cool. So here in the middle display command display you have basic stuff like navigation 
radio, media, telephone, in-car office. Connect vehicle and in vehicle you have ambient lighting and also the first one is so we have seats, climate control, so in seats we have a massage, so in seats we have massage, lumbar support, so super super cool. Climate control, this is so advanced and yeah similar from other Mercedes vehicles and the MG vehicles. So here in system you can change other things as well. So super super nice. Okay guys, so let's put the seat how I would drive. Let's check out the rear seats. Okay. So nice. Wow. So brutal. So ambient lighting is present also in the rear seats. This is how it looks from the rear seat and it looks uh, incredible. So yeah. I'm speechless when I see this car. But yeah, I need to speak because this is a review. <laughs> so here we have also illumination and the G letter. So this is all weather matte also at the rear. And let me show you how this looks in the darkness. We have here the handle with the illumination, Burmester sound system. This is the handle, uh, heated seats. You can put down glass here, it is double. Privacy glass in double form. And we have these locks, these loud locks. So yeah, so, so nice. You have here also the AC for the rear, so you can choose uh, the fan level and the temperature. You have these uh, vents also, and also it's present here. So these are uh, the rear seats. They have also this cut here and uh, perforated leather. And the diamond cut also in the doors. And the armrest here. like this you can also I think you can open this also from the rear like a ski hatch and you have two cup holders here I'm doing this without the light so you can see how this looks with ambient light this is like a night simulation the suede ladder here on the top and we have a handle a little light here hanger another one we have went here and what is interesting in the G-Class, here is like an open space. So let me show you. This is uh, here the, <laughs> the boot space and it's like, uh, yeah, it's open. So you can see here, I will show you that from the outside. So, so nice here. So guys, here at the rear, I have a uh, a lot of space as you can see this is like I don't know like 30 centimeters I'm 186 centimeters or six feet and between one and two inch and I have super super a lot of space here and also for my knees so I will show you that uh, in a second but yeah this is my knee room and I have like this much space the, the G-Class grown in length as well significantly so you have a lot of space here before it was not like this in previous generation so they make a great adjustment in terms of the size and how cool is this all right guys so let's open the door and check out the rear the boot space but first let's check out uh, these doors 
So they have the same upholstery like in the interior and also the carbon fiber on the handle. So how gorgeous is this? It's uh, really crazy. And there you can see the spare tire actually. So this uh, boot size is 454 liters, which uh, I would say is not a lot, but uh, in terms of the number. But when you are looking at the boot, you, was, you would say, wow, this is really large. And that's uh, the number up to this, uh, like a roller, uh, which separates actually the cargo space. But if you would uh, buy like a cage, which is sitting behind the rear seats, uh, then you can fill uh, the boot up to the top. And then you have like thousand liters, maybe even more. So you would have like super large uh, boot space. And you have all rubber mats and you can tow also with this car. You have subwoofer there, as you can see on the left side. And also on the bumper, you have these like a sandpaper decors. That's really interesting. So overall, that's a really utility vehicle. And yeah, guys, that's it from this video. If you enjoyed it, then let me know in the comment section down below. Like this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And I will see you soon in the next video. Have a wonderful day.